Adrian Hauser tried to pick things up rock it's been a tough go for him over his last six starts. Yeah he was really good his first two starts a point seventy five earned run average in his first two last six over seven so he's looking to turn things around trying to take care of Contreras who's been the hottest Cubs hitter in the last dozen games average nearly four hundred one two and he chased down and away with a breaking ball. It's a clean one two three inning for Adrian Hauser. It's Alex Mills making start number nine. First ever start in Miller Park. Second start against the Brewers this year. Keston Hira started every game for Milwaukee. Full count. Change up swung on and missed strike three. Both teams go one two three in the first. Two out walk first time the Brewers have had traffic. The shortstop Arcia right right matchup they're going in and on a bounce played by Kipnis so two complete on a Sunday afternoon nothing nothing one out one on here's Baez the old one hit on the ground to third and Sogard couldn't handle it so that'll be another Brewers error. Two men on with one down. Let's see if that play represents a turning point. Jason Hayward at the plate. And the pitch, and that ball will land in left. And the Cubs will grab the lead. Schwarber scores. It's one to nothing. There's the first hit. Jason Hayward having a great series. He pulls in at second with a double, in fact, as Baez motored to third. Cubs lead one to nothing. Jason Kipnis at the plate. Cubs lead one to nothing. Kip Round ball and they're going to throw nowhere. Everybody safe. Hauser looking for some help defensively and he hasn't gotten much the last two innings. I don't know if Hira really had a play on Baez, but his goal was to throw to the plate. Yeah, in infield in and he charges this ball aggressively. Almost took a page out of the Harlem Globetrotters there going <laughs> Hira to Hauser to first, but they did not get the out. So two nothing first and third and the batter is Victor Caratini. The 1 0 to Caratini fly ball shallow center. That ball is going to fall in for a base hit. Hayward comes in to score Cubs lead three to nothing. Everything going the Cubs way in the inning. Caratini did not hit the ball hard but he'll take it. Here's Hap with three on and three already in. Lined and it'll get in there. Kipnis scores. Caratini right behind them. 5 0. 5 0 Cubs over the Brewers. One away here in the top half of the fifth inning. Jason Kipnis at the plate. At the end of the bat. And Yelich will make the catch. Schwarber will score. Also Baez safe at third. 6 0. Sack fly Kipnis. He's knocked in two today. And Javi scores. It's seven to nothing. So Javi always heads up. Apparently, time was not called. Craig Council is going to come out of the dugout. Craig Council is probably not going to stop until he's kicked out. I get, I get the sense reading the body language of Craig that his heart's not really into it. Uh, <laughs> maybe starting to warm to the task now. Council's argument has to be that the ball was the ball. Or the play should have been dead and shut down. That's got to be his argument that the play is done and time is out. Don't take your eyes off of El Mago. Council continuing to press it. There you go. There's the, yep, there's the obligatory heave ho. So Caratini draws a two out walk, and that'll bring up David Bodie. Cubs leading the Brewers seven to nothing. They've already scored twice here in this fifth inning. Can't do it. Bodie. Deep left, is it fair? It is gone. Two run homer, it's nine, nothing. Alec Mills has continued to be very sharp here today. How long he can maintain this no hit effort. Hayward and right. So Alec Mills leading nine, nothing as a no hit bid through five. Mills has still not given up a base hit through seven innings. Stay tuned. We go to the eighth. He's going to take a no no into the eighth with a 10 0 lead. 
Brewers without a run, without a hit. I can't really think of too many balls hard hit against Mills all day. Slow curveball popped up foul might be playable for Caratini. It is out number one. And everybody at the railing in the Cubs dugout watching Mills. Ground ball, backhanded Baez. He gets him two away. We're on the edge of our seats. He's on the edge of the strike zone. A swing and a pop fly on the infield. Playable for Bodie at third. He's got it. And Alec Mills has not allowed a base hit through eight innings. Alec Mills out to work the bottom of the ninth inning. Jacob Nottingham is first up. Mills coming back 1-0. Swing and a pop up. Right side might be playable for Rizzo. He's got it. Out number one. Rizzo in foul territory ran right through the coach's box and grabbed that ball on the run. Mills two outs away from history. Tyrone Taylor's first plate appearance. The one two serve. He got him swinging two down. Mills now is one out away. Jace Peterson at the plate. He is one out away. Up the got middle. By his head. made history in Milwaukee. Alec Mills has just pitched a no hitter. A no hitter for Cubs right hander Alec Mills. A ground ball to Baez a routine play. The Cubs are mobbing the young right hander on the mound jumping up and down. What a great moment for Alec Mills as the Cubs win the ball game 12 to nothing.